Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to calculate the work required to move a charge from one location to another inside an electric field. So, the first thing to notice is that work is equal to the change in electric potential and the change in electric potential is equal to the change in voltages times the magnitude of the charge. If we rearrange just this part of the formula, we get that the change in voltage equals the change in electric potential divided by the magnitude of the charge. So we've got the question, an electron starts moving from a point where the electric potential was negative 100 volts, and it moves to a new point. As it moves, the kinetic energy increases by 1.2 times 10 to the negative 6 joules and we want to know what is the electric potential at its new location. So we know that we're dealing with an electron which means Q, the magnitude of the charge, is equal to 1.67 times 10 to the negative 19 coulombs and any formula sheet you're working with should tell you what the charge of an electron is. We know the change in the electric potential is 1.2 times 10 to the negative 6 joules. And that divided by the charge on the electron is going to be equal to the change in voltage. And the change in voltage is going to be the voltage where it ends up minus the voltage where it's Started. So we know, I'm just going to say that's voltage final minus voltage initial, and the voltage final is what we don't know, and we know that the voltage initially was negative 100 volts. The first thing I would notice is that we're going Vf minus negative 100. That's going to be the same as a negative minus a negative is the same as adding. That's going to be Vs plus 100 equals whatever this turns out to be. So on your calculator, I would go 1.2 times 10 to the negative 6 equals, divide by, open bracket, 1.67 times 10 to the negative 19, close bracket, and hit equals. And when I did that on my calculator, I got 719. Then all you need to do is subtract that 100 from both sides, and you should get that the final voltage is equal to 719 minus 100 is 619 volts. 